In this video we're going to look at how to set up your new class notebook in 18 or a new team for the year. So I've opened up my um, nine digital solutions here and I'm going to in the very beginning post here just going to click on set up class notebook. So this is going to go through and take me to the class notebook tab. I click on that set up class notebook and I'm going to say from existing notebook content. Now because I've got last year's um, material in my OneNotes, I can choose that. So I'm going to click from existing content. I'm going to go next. I'm going to choose how I actually set up my um, content library. Um, so I'm going to choose my add content here um, for the content library. So in here, I'm going to say uh, my nine digital solutions. There it is down there and go next and then from the content library I want to include all of these tabs so that is the units that I teach in year 9 digital and um, I'm going to say done so that's the ones that have been imported there um, I then say add content for teacher I'm not sure if I have any teacher content areas that I want I'll just check and in the teacher only content um, I've just got a lot of old stuff in there which I really don't want any of that material I might put the improvements in which is my notes and how I'm going to improve my unit as I as I work through so done and then I go next I'm then choosing how I'm actually going to lay out now I don't uh, I don't like this um, handout for class night homework. I don't like using it that way so I'm going to delete those away. I'm going to add a section here and you can see the sections that I had was um, uh, ro uh, um, robotics and then I can say so this is reflecting um, what's actually in the content library and then the next one I had was um, game design and then game design project so they're the four sections which will reflect the four components of, of my unit um, you may choose instead to have term one term two term three term four but they're my four units there um, so I'm just going to go create and now this is going to go through the process of creating my class notebook um, and I'm just going to pause here and wait for this to actually happen. It'll take a bit of time. It's doing a lot of churning in the background. Um, so when this is finished, I'm just going to pause this and then come back and talk to you when it's finished. So you can see this message has now popped up saying our class notebook is ready. Um, and it's going to send me a message when all the sections have been copied. So in the background, it's now copying all the material from my previous um, OneNote to here. Now it's interesting, it's important to note, it doesn't actually have to be a class notebook that you're extracting information from. Um, I just did that because I had my previous year nine unit, but you can actually get information from a OneNote that someone shared with you or your own personal OneNotes and then put that information into um, into your new class notebook. So that's how you start a new class notebook with the content already included.